Talking with Hofstra head coach Simon Ridioff and coach four of your players win conference awards. Just talk about what their accomplishments means to you as their coach. Well, again, uh, we all like to get awards and we all think we deserve them to some extent. Uh, but, but for me, for Lear and Jill to get their first team as freshmen is a tremendous uh, accomplishment. And then also uh, Ruby Stapler, she she got uh, she got her just desserts as well. She she's had a really consistent season, and it's nice to be recognised by the other coaches. And Brooke Bendenager, we know how uh, our leadership is and what she brings to our team. And uh, she was a award winner last year, so I think I think because of that and and. Uh, how vocal she is and how uh, easy it is to notice so she gets it again so I'm pretty happy with all four I think they all deserve it um, I think again it shows with Leah and Jill that we can keep them, them too happy for the next three four years Off she's in a good place and not to look too far ahead but with uh, Jill and Leah winning these awards just what does that speak to the future of this program no exactly I think uh, you know it's a good foundation uh, we we also have Chloe Dale and Janine Moyedo who's done a great job this year. So we thought Chloe deserved to be on the rookie team as well. Um, Leah Hinnan and, and Sam Calvert's been playing really hard as freshmen. I think the foundation's there. Um, I think we're very happy with what we've got going on. And if we can sprinkle some more players in there and get, get some people ha healthy and happy, I think we'll be pretty good. And from a team aspect, looking to tomorrow with the semifinals against William & Mary, they uh, have the Conference Player of the Year, a very talented team, and just talk about the challenging matchups they're going to present. Well, William & Mary is good. Uh, they've got a, a tremendously talented coach and a group of individuals are, are probably the best team in the conference, uh, talent-wise. They've got weapons everywhere, uh, but I think the last time we played them, we showed that we can compete, and hopefully, uh, as with anything in the playoff game, anything can happen, and if we get organised and work hard, I think, I think we've got every, every bit as good a chance as anybody else. What's the confidence of this team like after a penalty kick victory against Northeastern to get to this point? Well, it's good. It's, uh, being in a playoff situation and getting through 90 minutes and overtime and PKs is good for the team to, to experience that. Uh, William and Mary haven't experienced that this year. So we, we've already got a slight advantage because we've been through it. And hopefully as we uh, as the game goes on tomorrow, we've, we've had that feeling. We know what it's like to be in a one and on situation. And uh, hopefully that'll help us soothe the nerves as we move forward. All right, Coach, well, good luck. Yeah, thanks.